Hello, hello everyone. I hope that you are all doing well. So this is a place that I like because you see over there, I think it's full of history. And when you see over there, this was built by the Nazi and there was a canon, you know, and they were like shooting, bam, bam. And in fact, uh, the American and some French who were here to liberate Paris, they came here and many of them died, you know, when they fight the Nazi at the end of Second World War. And I think that's very interesting to discuss this regarding the event that happened now and remind people, remind you what's the meaning of human rights. I think too many people have don't, they don't have, they don't have any idea what's human rights. And that's because you have all this propaganda coming from China and coming from other countries that destroyed human rights. Human rights doesn't matter. Human rights is nothing, it doesn't matter. And in fact, this is, this is also a part of globalization. So these guys, they told us, oh, let's have globalization. Let's have globalization. Uh, we're going to, uh, to uh, have made in China, made in India, made in Eastern, Eastern Europe, and it's, everything is good and uh, we, don't need, we can do this. And that's fine to work with China. That's fine to work with, with the whole world. Uh, we are all the same, right? We are all the same. Uh, no, we are not the same. Because uh, some countries, they have a belief in human rights and some countries, they don't have human rights. We don't have the same values. We don't have the same system and we don't have the same culture, okay? This is something that I always tell you. Let me take a photo here from my WeChat so my friends can, can enjoy a little bit. Okay, and I try to stay try to stay away from the other children. I don't know where is my kid. Anyway, um, something that you need to understand. Here, when I live in France, I have, since I, I am, like since I'm a kid, you know, when I was a kid, there was only white people, native French people. Now I'm, you are here in Paris, one out of five uh, uh, persons that you meet on the street is a foreigner, one out of five. And then the one that are left, the five people that are left, maybe there will be half of them, maybe two, uh, that will be a uh, French national born abroad. So it's very likely that these guys, unfortunately, many of them are not going to share your culture and are not going to share your ideas and your system, okay? Uh, some of them, they will integrate very well, but most of them, they will never be able to integrate because you can never change your own culture, never. You know, the only way that you can change is getting replaced. So when you are a kid, yeah, you can, you can shape your own education as a kid, and then that's it. You know, as I told you quite often, I was in China 13 years. I will never be Chinese and I'm never a Chinese, you know. Uh, someone else uh, will never be a French guy, uh, no matter how long he stays here. Maybe if he comes here at 20 years old, 25, get married to a French woman, a kid here stays for 10 years. Yeah, maybe, maybe, some people, maybe, uh, to a certain point, to a certain point. What I mean is that human rights is not simply a word. Human rights is, is something that uh, has huge implication. So what does it mean? It means that you have the freedom to express yourself on the YouTube channel and say, oh, I don't like here. The dogs, they poo everywhere. This is very dirty. You have the freedom to do this. It means that you have the freedom uh, to say, I don't want to eat GMOs or I want to have uh, this kind of food or that kind of food. You have the freedom to say this. You have the freedom to say, oh, I believe that women should, uh, should be, shouldn't go uh, out or should, be, uh, should uh, go out. You have the freedom to say whatever you want, okay? It means that because of this freedom, there is consequence. Attends, chérie, je, je termine. There is, there is consequence with this freedom. One consequence is that you have a higher life quality, okay? Because this is my freedom to eat fresh vegetable, okay? If you don't, you must afford me fresh vegetable. If you are not able to afford me fresh vegetable, then I probably will go on the street, go on strike, uh, sue, uh, sue you, whatever. You know, this is part of my freedom. This is part of, of the human rights. So, 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 okay. uh, so this, is, this is part of my freedom. This is something that you have to understand. You know, um, when I see so many Chinese people who come here in France, and I can tell you when you are in Paris, you see many. And you know, you talk to them and they are like, eh, I don't like it here. In fact, um, China is the best, China is better. Oh yeah, the Chinese government is good, oh, this is good. And, and that's what you hear all the time. And then you wonder why they came here. And then you find out, oh, that's, I know why they came here. They came here because they came for the environment, the quality of the environment, the trees, uh, the blue sky, they came here for this. 
They came here because here they have quality education, that's free, free education. They came here because they can benefit from free hospital, healthcare, and all this. They came here because they can make money. They came here because they can buy a land with a garden. They came here, and when you think about all this, one by one, all these are the consequence of the culture and the system. Why do we have holidays in France? Because we fought for holidays. For a long time, we didn't have holidays. Why do we have retirement pension in France? Because we fought for retirement pension. Why uh, are the French women equal to the men? And they, uh, because we fought for this. You know, if, uh, once uh, 50 years or 70 years ago, that was not the case. There was huge inequalities. Okay, and this is linked to human rights. This is what we call basic human rights. Okay. And above this is the morality, the morality, like, I'm not going to do this, okay, it's not against the law, but I have a hurt. And it's not only about making money and fucking other people, that's not me, I cannot do it, okay? Oh, I know, that's easy, I can fuck other people, but that's not what I'm going to do, you know, because I have a hurt. I can sell it three times the price, but I'm not going to sell it three times the price, because that's not what I want to do, you know, because I'm not Chinese, or I'm not going to sell it three times the price, you see, because that's not my education. My education tells me I shouldn't do this, else I will go to hell, or this is something bad to cheat people and ask them three times the price, you see. Uh, uh, I have my own morality. I have my own moral standard. Everyone has his own moral standard. Someone say, oh, that's okay, it's just business. I'm selling it three times the price, it's just business. Oh, they need medicines. <laughs> you need medicine, my friend. Oh, it's like, oh, you need water. You are in the desert, you need water. Uh, oh, fine, if you need water, you, uh, you need a glass of water. I will sell it for, to you for a million because you have your back against the wall. And if you don't get this water, you die. Oh, you need the medicine. <laughs> oh, you really need it. I'm going to sell it to you. Yeah, there's no pity, you see. And some people are not going to do this because they have a, a higher standard, higher moral standard, okay? Uh, and this is something that is, of course, at, has everything to do with the education and the culture. It's not about being nice, kind, or bad, or he's a bad guy, or he's a bad girl, or he's nice, she's not nice. What does it mean, being nice? You know, everyone is nice. You know, I'm a nice person. You know, I'm a nice person, but I will still sell to you this three times the price because my moral standard is here, and I don't care because in the society, that's how it is. So we have two issues here. One issue is the, how we define the system and the lack of human rights. And of course, it, nobody cares. N nobody cares. It's every man for himself. At some point, you have less and less human rights. You know, I don't care. Oh, yeah, they don't get retirement pension. I don't care. Oh, women get beaten on the street. Oh, I don't care. Oh, this is this. Oh, I don't care. You know, and the other thing is um, the lack of morality. How high is your moral standard? How high is your moral standard? And many people have a very low moral standard. Why? Because the society now, it pushes you to have a low moral standard. If you're kind and you're telling the truth and you say, oh, be careful. Oh, you shouldn't do this. Oh, no, that's not good. I'm not going. Then you don't win. You don't win, you know? But you, if you are assholes and you have many assholes, it's the country of assholes, and then you can manage. You can have success. If you lie to the people like the politician, like Macron, like all these guys, yeah, you can manage. That's very good, you know? You can say anything to people, they'll believe you. They are fools. You can cheat them. Ask them 10 times the price. Tell them what they want to hear. And then, then that's how it works. Okay. Let me leave you. You see, there's not so many people. Yeah. And okay. Uh, take care, everyone. I love you all.